Okay, guys, here we got ourselves a 1977 Silver with Silver Flames Corvette. This thing is really sharp. Nice color on there. I love how the flames just go right back into the silver paint. They stand out. You see a little bit of red in there, but it's still two-tone like silver color. I like it. It's, it's really nice, but it does blend in well with this red interior here. And this thing is a nice car for a 77. It's really clean. Got your removable tops. The front end glass is in great condition. As we walk around back, rear bumper, your duals. Back in the car looks really nice. This is how 77 should look. Nothing like a whole vet. Let's look at the passenger side. As you can see, dashboard is in excellent condition. Center console, carpet, three speed automatic, but the seats are really in great condition, man. These seats are beautiful. Let's do the driver's side. Okay, guys, looking at the driver's side of this beautiful Corvette. This is a nice vehicle, guys. Very nice. A little bit of wear on the steering wheel, but who cares? It's a 77. It's a vet. You can always replace that. Beautiful car. Let's look at the informational board. Okay, guys, you see the price. 77 Corvette, 350 V8. Three speed, that's silver with light gray flames. Hmm. Color on the inside is red. 65 undocumented miles. Sitting here at Gateway Class of Cars in Crete, Illinois. If you like the car, give them a call. Need any more information? Drop a comment down below. Okay, guys, here we got a 1989 Mustang LX 5.0. And this thing has some power to it because it's got a lot of extra little toys that were added on here. And uh, we're going to take a nice look at this thing. Has the pop top roof. You got a few little gauges right here. On the outside. <laughs> Basically, this is a summertime car because there are no windshield wipers on it. As we look in the inside here, five speed manual. The seats are in excellent condition for it to be the 89. It's bright regatta blue exterior paint gray on the inside and evidently this thing must be running dump offs because <laughs> with the LX models you used to have the tailpipes that come all the way back hatchback style Decent looking car, you know. Nothing that stands out to say, hey man, you might want to check into this thing. But other than being a nice car, this thing is really nice. For those of you who care about back seats in a Camaro and a Mustang, well, 
as you can see, they're your back seats. <laughs> Let's take a look at the information aboard. All right, guys, you see the price. 89 Mustang, 302 V8, five speed. With 78,000 undocumented miles. And sitting here at Gateway Classic Car, you like the car, give them a call. Okay, guys, here we got ourselves a beautiful, beautiful Chevy C10 1964 step side pickup truck. This thing is beautiful, man. I'm really digging this paint job on here, guys. This thing is beautiful. As we take a good look at this front grill, Chevrolet and the American flag all on it. This thing is very, very nice. Taking a good look down the side of this baby. It is pretty. I love this paint on here. Got your exhaust tip right there. Come around the back. Nice bumper back here. For those of you who love to see the wood in the back of the bed, there you go. Fresh wood back here. And instead of, you see, you see the chrome pieces, you got the painted steel pieces in there. This thing is beauty and it's a custom. It's a stick shift, by the way. We're gonna see if we get down in there a little bit. Yeah, guys, it's real nice. As you see the stick on the floor, looking at this interior here. There's no headliner, but it's painted all in the cab. That's beautiful, man. This is a nice truck. Let's check out the passenger side. As you can see, there's your other exhaust tip for the dual exhaust on here. You got to have dual exhaust on the sidestep truck, man. Nice Chevy truck, man. Please. You got to have it. I'm just blown away at this paint job, man. This thing is so nice. I'm going to take a good look at the top of the cab. Whoever restored this did an excellent job. The glass and everything is immaculate. Dashboard, front dash, everything. You got your get your tack and your gauges right in the middle. I mean, excellent. And you get to look at that stick shift. It's real nice. Thing of beauty. And these custom seats that's in here, I like that. I do believe that folds back up so you could put a, another person in there, but small, maybe a kid or whatnot. But this is a beautiful truck on the inside. Okay, guys, we're looking at the motor of this beautiful Chevy truck. And it is a big boy sitting in there. And as soon as they get the information on this truck, I'm sure they're going to have the specs on this motor but what i'm looking at nice interstate battery an aluminum radiator here what i'm looking at i almost want to say it's a 396 but it could be a 427 and uh as i said until we get the specs i'm not sure but that is a big Orange black Chevy motor sitting down there, and there's headers on it. There are headers on it, so yeah, this thing was made to rumble. You know, nice, nice, nice restoration. P 
paint it all up under the hood. That's what you're looking for when you get a vehicle like this. You're spending your money. You want to get it where it's right. You know, this is a nice, nice vehicle. Oh, yeah. Right now, they don't have information aboard, but as soon as I find out something, if you're interested in this vehicle here at Gateway Classic Cars, leave a comment down below. I'll be sure to get some information for you. All right, guys. Later.